Welcome back. Ewok Templar. Dread Templar. We made it into the Soul Melting Factory. Let's see what's going on in this Soul Melting Factory. What if you don't have a soul? What do they do then, huh? Ask you nicely to leave? You can't have it, it's mine. Kinda of sucks. Oh my god. I must be going now. My planet needs me, brother man. Alright. It's working out kind of. What the? Thought I killed that one. Now we could use the demon gloves. What? All right. I can't believe they whipped out Big Purple Boy again already. Okay, he's dead now. Lord Almighty, I'm surprised I did so well. Let's reload our guns. I <laughs> used up a lot of SMG, that's okay. Used a lot of the regular bullets over there. There you go, that's, that's fine. They came at me hard. How'd I get that ammo? What the? What? Oh, you're still alive up there. My bad, bro. I wasn't trying to be rude. I wasn't trying to pretend like you weren't up there. Oh, you're still alive! Were there two of you up there? Because like, that's where I saw that death animation, yeah. Alright, there's a one health kit down there and a way out. So remember that. Ooh, and a, t and a way forward. The tunnel down there. Huh, oh, looks like I have to push some buttons to be able to access some of this stuff up here. <clears throat> yeah, okay. Hold on, there's a way into the middle. Inspect that. Ah! Armor shards. Nice. I'm not gonna touch the purple goo, because I'm assuming it's gonna be hot. And, and full of... Full of the precious goo material-like stuff. Ooh, big armor. <laughs> We're doing pretty well now. Revolver ammo. I like that. Hmm. Alright. We need the purple key and the red key for this bridge over here. But over here, not so much. Can I make that? I can. Now I just gotta do it again. I'm gonna leave that armor there. Because you never know, you might need it. But, oh! Oh, the secret area just leads you back to the beginning. Alright, let's go save right here then. Let's do it. <laughs> we did a lot. We did a lot just then. We handled that purple guy battle room very well, I want to say. Wish that was faster. It was, that was, Saving the game was a little bit faster on controller than, uh, than that. Okay, I think the only way forward now is down there through the purple goo secret entrance. I could have jumped for those. that stuff over there too. Let's go ahead and grab that. The armor shards. Nah, you know what? I'm already at 75 armor. I'm gonna lo lose it anyway. But it looks like we come back to this room and there's two ways to go, so we might as well save it for later. Oh, you piece of malacca. Gotcha. That worked out very well. I don't even know what Malaka is. <laughs> Malaki. Wasn't that one of the names? <laughs> A wrong. 
Oh, I didn't mean to grab that. D nice. Do we have a D nice in here? I actually got him in three. Hey, those pistol shots must have been spot on. I gotta remember that this game actually does have bonuses to uh, headshot damage. So, that's probably why I know I was complaining in the previous episodes that, like, it's uh, kind of uneven, so enemies take more damage, which maybe some are elites, but they don't. I'm hoping that if they are, there are elites, they're at least colored differently, because otherwise they look the same. Perky. Touch this. Aha! Ooh, I can't grab that, though. That's Fist of the North Star ammo. Yeah, I'll prove it to you. It's a cut the secret. Yeah, I can't pick it up. I don't want to use it though, just because I like to save for bosses. I guess next time we run into our purple big dude, I'll fire one at him, see how it goes. It's blood. Okay, it's just blood. I can grab that ammo freely. Okay. Let's go up this way then. I don't trust it just because it's a narrow corridor. We got him. What's this do? This opens up this. Might make it easier to jump for those shards over there. Singular revolver bullets, we're good. We're Gucci. I'm gonna touch those walls. Touch these walls. So why do we want to do this? I guess I'll grab these armor shards now that I'm over here then. Oh, that's kind of confusing. I guess I could jump for that and then jump for those over there. Seems a bit much though. Safe to say that I'm supposed to flip that switch for some mysterious reason. Some nebulous switch flipping reason. And then I'm supposed to come back down here again and go to the other side over here. Watch the goo. Hold on. Just in case, touch it. Oh, you know what? I missed another secret. I just realized during the battle, I jumped up somewhere and there was a break point. I think it's over here. I just remembered. Yeah, there it is. Aha! Uh -huh. Well, where the f is this? I'm sort of a deep down dark dungeon. I'm gonna touch everything. By the way, if you recognize the song, I believe it's the exact same song that was playing in the level beforehand. The side area. The side piece. She has her own area where we keep her. It, yes. Oh my god. Click on it. Bro. Ooh, there's an abyss down here. Oh, is this a puzzle area? It is. Ow. We gotta move past the purple real fast. Okay, this is sealed off, so I wasn't even supposed to go this way. Oh god. Oh my god. Well then. This is just designed to eat up all your armor and health, isn't it? Well, I thought I got it. I got the thing. Reminds you of Nightmare Reaper. Wish my damage reduction thing was higher, because that sucked. Let's go ahead and go over here. Well, I mean, I, we got it done early, so I guess it's fine. We gotta go up now and grab that armor, though. I don't like this. 
It was a bit rough. I feel like I could have done a little bit better. Definitely, there's probably a way if you go sweaty mode, you take no damage. Gotcha. Fair enough. All right, this time things will be different. This time I'm going straight for the noise and going to do my mission. How did I know? How did I know that the parasite would follow? goes all my armor so grabbing it was kind of pointless because the room was going to be small and filled with explosives but i'll make it work what the this blood soap skeleton it seems to be part of some kind of ritual some sort of blood ritual some sort of bad juju ritual this skeleton's also part of that ritual but why and how? Oh, the red key card. Surely nothing nefarious will happen here. All right, no secret behind this key card. All right. And I can't touch the purple stuff because it's spicier than the blood. That's all right. Think about what you did. Mine. <laughs> Death. Destruction. Desolation. The Red Faction. Listen to me, so far. Alright, now I'm over here. Now I'm grab the, grabbing these shards. Oh, I have both the keys now. Oh, Russell Crow. I'm oh, sorry, I'm a little. I spaced out there for a second. Let's go. Actually, hold on. What about that ammo? Yeah, because now, now I'm actually running low on this. Give me a second. I think I'm okay on shotgun. Hey, it's not great, but it's not bad. But I left that right there. Yeah. Woo! Skip, dive, dodge, dip, dodge. Wish I had more ammo, but then I ran into a room where there were apparently four bomb dudes and two slap boys. They decided to melt my armor away and use it for nefarious reasons. Touching me inappropriately, if you ask me. I'm not sure I approve of it. I want to call Chris Hansen now. I don't know about that. How old is the Dread Re the Dread Templar? Uh-oh. I don't like the way this looks. This looks like they're setting me up to fight something. Blood a single blood jewel. Why is this one here if there's not gonna be something floating there? He couldn't give me an aspect right there. Am I too cool for another aspect? Is that what's happening right now? I only get bloodstones. It's whatever. Let's, let's take a look. What we got? We got four. We're already running the damage reduction. What do we have here for katanas? Recall. After killing a demon by throwing the dual katanas, put down the dual katanas as a chance of a fish uh, immediately. Only in throwing mode. Lightning Spear increased. Extra lightning damage after, after the target is killed by the lightning spear will cause a small lightning explosion, causing lightning damage to nearby enemies and lock them down. 
Only in, oh, so it's all throwing upgrades. So right, let's look at the pistols and SMGs. Let's see. There's the ammo one that I really want to get. I don't think I need the attack speed. I should probably equip slaughter too for the damage and then go ammo. And then what do I get? Oh man, what's this? That looks cool. Holy scream. Dual pistols are transformed into dual hell screams. They fire powerful fire projectiles that can pass through the enemy. Ooh, I want that. That's what I need. Ammunition depot. Piece of maximum ammo of pistols and SMGs. Carried by 200. That's a big ammo upgrade. Neo. Bring some more time. The damage of the pistols is massively enhanced and does not cost ammunition. Oh, no. oh, that's awesome too. Neo, I get it. Bullet storm. Cancel reload this pistol. I really want one of those. Hold on, let's look at the shotgun ones too. What we got? I number of enemies around a character there, the more damage the double barrel shotgun will do. This effect only works on the double barrel shotgun. Zella, okay, sniper shotgun. So then we reduce the damage to K at long range of the pump shotgun and reduce the dispersion. This effect only works with the pump shotgun. That would be okay if the dispersion of the pump shotgun wasn't already, like, kind of narrow. This narrows it even more, but, like, he also increases the range, which is fine. It's okay. I'm not gonna worry about that. No, I don't even know why I'm looking at these down here. I don't have enough points to get any of those. I can only get that one or that one. The shotgun one or the sword one. I don't want either one of those right now. But I do have enough points to get two level two, so we can get the black... The bow. What's this? We just cool down the black bow. Ooh, I want that. I definitely want that. These stuff, this stuff over here already does so much damage. So I think, honestly, and I also, I, the trap launcher, I only like using it against spiders. There's no other really tiny enemy that it kills in one shot. Although other enemies just shocks them and doesn't do enough damage in my opinion. So honestly, right now, I really want to work towards that, the fire one. So I think I'm gonna upgrade the black bow. And the S pistols for now. What's this one? That one's minus two, that one's minus two. Yeah, I can get both of these. So over here, what we're gonna do, first of all, I wanna reset that slot and put the double the double damage in it. And then put the ammo increase right there. And then I wanna grab this one, boom. And get uh, cooldown reduction. What's this one? This one's increase the ammo of arrows. I think it's only increases it by one. So I'm gonna go ahead and do the damage increase instead for now. But I think I have to unequip this one. Yeah. Okay. Because now with the reduction time, it will recharge my arrows faster. I think I like that. And I definitely want to move towards the fire bullet guns. All right, we're doing pretty well on everything actually. We're full on ammo. That's good and bad because What's gonna be in this next room, I wonder? He asked knowingly. What did I just upgrade? Oh yeah, the pistol actually went up to 240. That's nice. Oh yeah, there is some sort of mini boss fight. Didn't, didn't back up right. Honestly, I think the shotgun swapping is actually a really good technique. I've been doing it for a while now. And it works out really well. We've got another aspect here. Inferno Revolver Expansion. More Inferno shots. God knows I'm going to enjoy that. 
there something back here? No? Okay. That looked like the type of wall where there might be something. But there was nothing. I don't even know where that guy's head is. Can't talk to me like that anymore, I'm a flag girl. I'm gonna assume I need to aim for his eyeball. Density has increased, but my damage hasn't increased enough for me to feel like it doesn't matter. I'm running low on shotgun now. Could you use some more shotgun ammo, would you kindly? This path keeps on going, I'm going here. I have no idea what's going on or why, so I'm just gonna take first service. A lot of health over here, that's nice. You're running low on shotgun, I don't like that. I got blessed. Really? Where did you even come from? Okay. The accuracy increase of mouse and keyboard is definitely helping me out here. I got. I saw that. I know who you are. Oh my god. It's freak job. Memorial service. There you go. Headshot with the bow. Finally. Something we can respect. Alright. He's dead. He's dead, Jim. Oh, what? That kills him in one headshot? There was a way to cancel a uh, shot. <laughs> Not that I care that I wasted that trap shot. There's no shotgun ammo around here. Come on, man. Ooh. Well, that's something. It's not shotgun ammo, but it's something. What the? Looks like there's a big med kit down here. Music's intensifying. Well then. Inferno Revolver Rush. Alright, I'll push it. This lowers whatever that is down. That's definitely a boss fight. What the? How is that fair? Wait a minute. They spawn right on top of me and stab me? That is rude. Rude game. Rude. How do I get that health that's below me? How do I get that health? Ow. Oh. Is that the only thing that's down there? I'm curious. Yeah, it's the only thing that's down here. That's good to know, though. It's not super bad to get to. 
but still. Oh my god, guys, can we, can we stop? I don't know how you survived all those shotgun shells. Can I get some skulls that hold me in a little less? Can I get that? Can we? Can you meet me halfway here? Where'd that other guy go? He died? Where are you going? I'm just throwing lead today because they're everywhere. That guy just straight up exploded. Whatever's happening. Gotcha. <laughs> God, I'm blessed. America. Okay. Gotcha. I'm really loving this bow. That damage upgrade with oh, headshot bonus damage that's really helping me out. Oh my god. Can please. dudes is he allowed to summon? Because it's getting ridiculous over here, okay? And this guy just threw a bomb right in my mouth. God bless it. Oh, before I jump into that death arena down there. Let me come over here. There's no way to cancel a shot. Ah, it's fine. It's fine. There's a mess load of ammo over here. And a dead end. Oh, I, I can open that now. Okay. Is anything I wanted to fiddle faddle with over here? A little bit more ammo. And the health and armor's right there. So I might as well grab it and save. Right? We'll pull up. Save. Looks like we got a mini boss fight down here. I'm gonna save some stuff. Whoa, 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 what am I supposed to do with, with the purple spikes? What am I supposed to do about that? What? Wait. What am I supposed to do about that? They literally covered the entire arena. Wait a minute. Hold the phone. That does not do as much damage as I would hope. That kind of sucks.
Am I supposed to be shooting those too? Okay, so they're actually useful against them. Wait, wait, what am I supposed to do about those? Okay. So it is an area effect that's measurable. Sucked. Can I go back up and collect some health and ammo? Yes and no. Uh, what? What's happening? Okay. That was... Didn't explain that to me. So this is you again. There's my gauntlet of power. It kind of sucked in the boss fight, to be honest with you. I don't know what it's for. Because it could have sworn it's for boss fights. It does a decent amount of damage against the boss, but not worth it. You get two shots worth about, like, a tenth of the boss's health bar. I'm gonna see if there's a secret in here where you jump down. Because the previous mission already hinted at something like that. <laughs> okay. Alright. Let's save. Ah. Well, I lost a lot of that armor already. What the what? Alright. Let's see how this handles that. Well, those two are dead now. Seems kind of pointless to me. Let's go talk to this guy. Just reload. I think we're doing actually better than I thought we were. Maybe not. I 
cleared out a few. We're definitely using all the resources inside this arena, though. an abyss gotcha huh against purple boys they do decent damage too that's good to know First it was quite harrowing, but then I saw I could keep on boogieing with my boogie shoes. I said, eh, let's just focus on fighting. I see. <laughs> I was like, hmm, for some reason my brain tickled there and I was like, wait a minute. And I turned to my right. A bunch of purple bar balls slowly moving towards me to murder me. I think I'm slightly out of his range, but that doesn't mean I should drop my defenses just yet. You know what I mean? I'm not getting any headshots here. There's one, and that's all I needed. All right. All right, now that I know purple boys are weak to the lightning trap, that's lightning trap slightly more useful. Still don't like it though. And this fist, this fist of the North Star thing, I kinda, it kinda sucks. It's it. it I'm betting when you get the ammo upgrade, it increases the three shots. Okay, so I can kill three purple bomb boys in one hit, and then I'll be able to do 30% of the boss's uh, life bar. But honestly, if, like, for that amount of ammo, like, you think it, already start with like four and then later on you upgrade it to five shots like if this is supposed to be the, B B the bfg like i remember when i got the bfg in like doom don't you start with like five shots and then you have to like the ammo is rare but you can save it up to where it has like a full clip of like 30 or something right so this just feels a little i don't know very watered down for like the BFG weapon in the game. That's just my opinion, though. Alright, so we're here at the Eye of Sauron, and we got these three obelisks that we need to deactivate, I'm assuming. Let's go to the red one first. Even though I think we were close to the green one at the beginning. Hopefully, every single time we deactivate one of these, this entire arena doesn't repopulate with a bunch of more enemies. But if it does, fuck. On the plus side, we can just try again. Honestly, knowing what I know now, I probably should have just done that. Yeah. <laughs> In front of rockets. Reach. What does that mean? Oh. Fist ammo. Do I have to reload the fist? Ooh, that one filled it up all the way. Oh, now that I know that, that actually... That, Makes them those ammo's more precious, I think. They're all right. Ooh, we need those. Actually, this would be the perfect spot. We're not. I'm gonna tap my tap my open button on these. Yes. Ooh. That's the biggest armor I've ever found. I'm gonna go over here and try to do the same thing. So here, anything? I think something for me, huh? Secrets? Flies? Okay, no. Wish there was a save point down here. Feels like I'm gonna have to fight as soon as I do this. One ring. Refuted. Let me guess. 
Yeah, there they are. Ow. All right, we got poison scorpions. That's a miss. That's one flyer down. Damn it. You know what? They're going to keep their distance. I'm just going to come back down here and actually wait a second for my stuff to recharge. Ow. All right, that's two of them. How do you guys, how do you Scorp Bros handle the revolver? That seemed to end you very well. Dang it. Stop moving. Stop resisting. Okay, wasn't so bad. Still though, that was a decent repopulation. Save, save, and then save again. Those be the rules. Alright, purple has upside down crosses don't mean anything, right? That's where I came in over there is the double. That single one over there is just floating there as a decoration. It does not mean that impure thoughts are happening. Just means that there might be some impurities in this area, in the general vicinity. Oh, I'm gonna tap these walls now. They give me plenty of fist ammo, at least. Plenty of ammo, at least. So I shouldn't be too worried. Nothing on this. Nothing on this. Is the red pillar the only one that had a secret? The second ring has been disengaged. Pray I don't not disengage any further. I hugged this one, right? Touched all this. I touched these. Yes, I did. Okay, just being thorough. No. Gotcha. Those guys are tough. Found out they're actually super susceptible to headshots. Just like those guys. Especially headshots from the bow. Gotcha. Alright. Didn't trust them. Dang it! Did you guys hang out together for a little bit? Thank you. <laughs> oh yeah. Doing pretty well. That one wasn't as bad as the one with all the flyers. Then again, my headshot game was on MLG. It was almost like being back in Halo 2. Touch. Touch. If I was a secret, wouldn't I be in one of these pillars, right? Am I right? Huh? Maybe trying to side? No, maybe not. We'll check the purple area. It's fine. Perp boy down here probably has something. Could you imagine trying to complete this game as a pacifist run? What? What hit me? I just took one exact damage when I walked right here. Why? Did I get too close to this corner right here or something? Temporary hitbox. Is there an enemy still alive? Way, like, a little dude? Hold on. I don't see any movement other than the liquids over there. Alright, I'm gonna touch everything again. 
Touch a wall again. I guess I could use a fist round against the regular enemies. They seem to be very susceptible to it. You know what I mean? Huh. Just the one secret then, eh? This only told me he's not just gonna be standing there and I have to fight him and I can use this entire arena. Besides, I don't like how much damage it does against the bosses anyway. Ah, oh, there's one of those dudes. Man. Got you. You're susceptible to headshots as well. Gotcha. Yes. <laughs> Man, that felt good. Tuck it and duck it. Any more? There he is. Way over there, missed him. Dang it. Meanwhile, Thunder Explosions is actually hitting me. Oh, there goes most of my armor. I was gonna use the fist against one of you guys. Now I'm very upset. You made me use up most of my armor against that stupid purple explosion stuff. And that look fist armor activated down there. Fist ammo actually. Something opened up on the bottom. I wonder if there's a bunch more armor down there now. Alright, everything's pretty good. I didn't even use the fist ammo. So we're fine there, I guess. Okay. Yeah, the entire assortment. Including the weapons, in case you missed them. I'm gonna have a save before I picked everything up, just in case. Because obviously, this is a boss fight that leads into a boss fight. This is another boss fight. Against Bro Dude. But why can't I reload? Oh. Alright, that was weird. What do I want to start with? The rocket launcher, the revolver. I guess this would be a good measurement of how tough he is. I guess I hit him with the fist first, right? Soften him up. Anywho. Face the boss. All right, I did a decent amount of damage. He has a second form. What? He's just gonna get tougher and tougher then as I fight him over and over again. Yeah. 
What am I supposed to do? Well then. Huh. Uh, I recommended me to go back and get the blood runes and stuff so I can actually kill him. <laughs> it's like, if you're having trouble, the try being better at the game. I'm like, oh, is that what I'm supposed to do? Thank you, dude. We have one point. Um, what do we have with the god? Oh, that takes two. Two. <laughs> two. One. We can upgrade the trap launcher. The effect of the trap. Ammo. Uh, launcher rush. Fire rate, fire rate. You got him down to half. You get him down to like, you take away a third and he goes to second form. Increase pistol and SMG damage. Next time I'm up, mm. I could go back and grind and then come back to this. Play something else for a while while I grind this and I'll lock all the upgrades up to this point. But we're not even halfway through the game. So like that disturbs me. <laughs> That I'm having to min max that much. Hmm. Let's try it one more time. And I think I already have all the damage upgrades unlocked. Oh, I could damage upgrade if the shotguns increase. Ammo, fire rate. I could reset this. And then put the level 2 damage in there. Huh. I wonder if that would work out. Like, I mentioned I upgraded my shotgun and my SMGs just to do damage and got rid of the ammo upgrades, right? We'll try that. All damage, pistol and shotgun. Hmm. I don't know. And I feel like to get him down to health, First thing I'm gonna do is wail on him with the sword. See if I can get him into shooting and dodging stance, you know what I mean? Let's go, let's do this. Oh, that does not do much enough damage, I don't think. I mean, that hurt him. I don't think he's very upset about it, though, you know what I mean? I don't think it's ruining his day. Yeah, same thing as last time. There it goes. Hold on, hold on, where is it? How come I can't select it? There we go. You're doing better than I did before. I got it. Oh, God. That's not fair. I did so much better that time, too. I got a little more away than half down. You know what, it's already been 56 minutes. I think I'm gonna leave this one here for now. I am gonna come back to this, though. I'm gonna grind this and figure this one out. Because I actually am interested in uh, I don't know why. Maybe I just need to get good, because I feel like there is like a scaling issue I'm feeling. I did read some of the rules that said like, yeah, if you don't max out all of your, if you don't go back and get all the runes and all the blood gems, it, it's actually like super hard. And maybe that's what I'm feeling right now. 
But I did get him. I didn't get him pretty close, didn't I? I didn't get him pretty close. But on the plus side, I can do go back to level select and then just find all the secrets and max out as much as possible. But for now, I'm gonna leave this episode here. Thank you all. Ewok Templar, we're going through Dread Templar. Hopefully you all enjoyed. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that like button. Keep on posting. We'll see you on the next episode. Y'all take it easy. Now we could use the demon gloves. I believe they've whipped out Big Purple Boy again already. Okay, he's dead now. Lord Almighty, I'm surprised I did so well. <laughs>